Hi everybody, today's focus, I am testing Mr. Clean Clean Freak to see how well it removes bacteria from around my home. This video is a viewer request. I received requests to test Clean Freak from Diana Wolf, Brandy Lynn Patrick, Christina Hartman, Coco Java Chip, and others. So I got this request and I went out and I purchased some Mr. Clean Clean Freak. It says on it, it's a multi-purpose cleaner. So I am not seeing on this right of way anywhere that it says that it is a sanitizer or a disinfectant. So I wanna make this really clear in the beginning of this video, they claim that they're a cleaner not a sanitizer and not a disinfectant. The only reason why I'm testing this against bacteria is because my viewers have requested it. So in order to test Clean Freak, what I'm gonna do is take a petri dish just like this guy here and label it A, B, and C. I'm gonna take some sterile swabs and I'm gonna swab various areas around my home, including my kitchen sink, kitchen sink drain, toilet rim, and bathroom sink, and I'll place those samples in the section labeled B for before. Then I'll clean according to the directions of the Clean Freak, Swab the area again and place those samples in the section labeled A for after. So this way we'll be able to see how much bacteria is on a surface before and after using Clean Freak. So let's read how we're supposed to use the Mr. Clean Clean Freak. It says right on the back here, pretty simple, spray on surface, wipe with a damp or dry cloth or paper towel. All right, that's pretty simple. Um, it does say it's great for greasy kitchen messes, uh, keep pumping for continuous coverage. Almost have a different kind of pump, that's fine. And it covers large surface areas with ease. Well, that's nice, that's good. And this one says it is a lemon zest scent. So what I'll be doing is just what it says in the back here, I'm gonna spray that surface and wipe it with a paper towel. So let's see how well Mr. Clean Clean Freak removes bacteria, even though it makes no claims to be able to, from my home. Now for some results. Let's have a look at the kitchen sink. In the before section, we can see a lot of bacteria. And in the after section, there's no bacterial growth at all. So the Mr. Clean Clean Freak did a great job of removing the bacteria from my kitchen sink. The kitchen sink drain. In the before section, we can see a tremendous amount of bacteria. And in the after section, we can see a visible decrease in bacteria. We still have some bacterial colonies hanging around, but there most certainly is a visible decrease. So the Mr. Clean Clean Freak did a pretty good job of removing the bacteria from my kitchen sink drain. The bathroom sink. In the before section, we can see a lot of bacteria. In the after section, there's no bacterial growth at all. So the Mr. Clean Clean Freak did a great job of removing the bacteria from my bathroom sink. The toilet rim. In the before section, we have a tremendous amount of bacteria. In the after section, there are just like three teeny tiny bacterial colonies. So the Mr. Clean Clean Freak did an excellent job removing the bacteria from my toilet rim. 
So this product did really well. Mr. Clean Clean Freak seemed to remove a lot of bacteria from the hard non-porous surfaces from around my home, even though they make no claims to be able to do so. I do really like to make sure everybody does know that. Nowhere on this packaging at all do they make any claims that they're a sanitizer or a disinfectant. It just says that they are a multi-purpose cleaner. This product does have a very interesting sprayer. It is not a classic trigger spray. You spray it and it kind of sprays for a longer period of time. I'm not a huge fan of that kind of sprayer, but it did work well at coating the area with the cleaner that I was looking to clean. As for the scent of this product, it is called Lemon Zest. And you know, it's pretty strong. It smells like fake lemon. This is not a real lemon scent. It's that chemically fake lemon scent. It's not a scent that I particularly like. I don't really like scented products. So if you're curious, it is kind of a strong fake lemon scent. Um, it didn't linger very long. Once I wiped the area, I didn't smell it. If there is a product that you would like me to test, do me a favor and put it in the comments section and I will add it to my viewer suggestion list or you can mail me something. My mailbox address is in the description below. Just do me a favor and send me an email first. That's also in the description below so we can have a conversation about the product. It might be something that I have in queue at home waiting to be tested. So let's just have a conversation about the product first. I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care. Have yourselves a great day.